Saber with another video, guys. So I'm going to talk about Everdome today. But before we do, let's just talk about the market. Bitcoin is falling, currently sitting at about 35k. In fact, let's just check the price of uh, Bitcoin. I believe it's 35k at the time of recording this video. 34 and a half K. All right, guys, so a massive dump for Bitcoin. A lot of people anticipating that we are now in a bear market, but I'm still waiting to see exactly what's going to happen. And I am in many altcoin positions. I don't hold any Bitcoin. I mean, many altcoin positions that I am still holding and do intend to just hold throughout of this. Okay, guys, but fortunately, I have been freeing up capital along the way in order to take advantage of audios and very new projects, because that is my strategy for this year, 2022. Getting into RDOs, new projects that have a lot of potential, that have big communities. Of course, you know, we, we've talked about Pulse X uh, and Pulse Chain. Very bullish on Pulse Chain and Pulse X. The sacrifice for Pulse X is just under a billion dollars. Okay, guys. So definitely positioning myself to be in those projects that I believe have the greatest long term potential and that are not necessarily bear market proof, but are launching in this time or very soon. I believe that. Pulse X will be launching around March time. Uh, so, yeah, I'm definitely looking to take advantage of this and, uh, you know, make sure that we get those gains and don't miss out on these bullish projects. All right, guys, because it's hard to pick the gems right now uh, in these market conditions. But Pulse X, Pulse Chain, Richard Hart, you know, Hex, you know, the whole ecosystem. Go back and check out my videos on Pulse Chain and Pulse X. Liquid Loans is another one that's coming soon that we'll be looking to take advantage of. So make sure you stick around on the channel, subscribe to the channel so you can get all the juicy information about these projects that I'm going to be bullish on for this year. But that being said, we're going to talk about Everdome in today's video. So Everdome aims to be the first hyper-realistic metaverse. You know, you've got your Decentraland, you know, all these different types of metaverses and not many of them look very real. I think one of the latest ones that I've seen is Victoria VR, which is using Unreal Engine, which looks pretty real. So that might be a compare for this as well. But Everdome is created by the founder of the hero token, Meta Hero. Now, Meta Hero clearly has performed um, since it came out the gate and this was also launched on Tencent which we're going to talk about because this is where the IDO for Everdome is being launched and uh, yeah Meta Hero did 175x so about 175x at the peak of the market especially for those that got in on the IDO on Tencent they were getting about 200,000 hero per one BNB 200,000 hero even today that's 11 thousand dollars 11 or just under twelve thousand dollars from one bnb so not a bad return on investment there so everdome is the second project launched by meta hero and they'll be using the everdome or the, the the meta hero 3d metaverse scanner you know if you don't know what that is basically they've got a dome it scans you into the metaverse you could scan your dog into the metaverse you can scan your phone into the metaverse or you know you can scan anything basically into the metaverse so it says here that everdome will provide a destination for meta heroes remarkable tech to live interact and flourish taking meta hero from the gateway into the metaverse together with everdome to a fully ubiquitous web free experience to the point where you could take off your vr headset you won't be able to tell what's real and what's not so they're going to provide an opportunity for everyone who's interested in a real to life version of the metaverse now with this project there is actually a pre-sale currently taking place so those that were holding a certain amount of meta hero uh, automatically got whitelisted for this pre-sale where they can put approximately 0.15 BNB into this. And if this does 175X, of course, you know, you're going to see a huge gain of just a small amount. Now, it's not to say that it will do 175X, but just based on what Meta Hero did, those are some of the projections that people could assume that could happen with this token if you're carrying over the same community with the same hype very small allocation into that of course that would you know introduce a lot of buying power into it as well if people want to pick up some more of that well not only that but there is a, a subscription on Tencent 
that will enable you to get this okay and before we talk about that actually there is also an airdrop that they're going to be doing to all meta hero holders that being said they did mention that in their group so if you did have enough to get whitelisted for the pre-sale Anyway, they're going to still do an airdrop for every single Meta Hero holder that there is. So I believe that if you pick up some Meta Hero now, you will still be able to qualify for that airdrop when this goes live on the 8th of February. Now for the 10 set subscription, you will be able to take part in the Everdome pre-sale or IDO. Five million dollars allocated to that. We don't know how many participants yet. We don't know what the max investment is going to be yet, but that will be taking place on the 24th of January. So just two days from now. In order to subscribe for this audio at the moment, the only way you can do it is to put 5,000 10 set tokens. Okay, guys. So 5,000 10 set tokens, you'll be able to get an allocation, a guaranteed allocation into this pre sale. If we look at the price of 10 set at the moment, uh, is two dollars okay and that's down from where i bought okay guys i actually put in three thousand ten set tokens at the time uh, to be able to participate in the idea so right now five thousand ten set tokens will cost you around ten thousand dollars so you know near about the same kind of price that i paid to get into this there is a little uh, admin fee as well um so you need to know um i believe it's probably 5,200 tokens or something around that mark. Okay, guys, but you can take advantage of that while the price for 10 set is down because obviously it has taken a dip. So that is definitely, you know, opportunity in the next couple of days to get into that. So as you can see, I put 3,000 tokens. Um, when you come to this page, uh, it will tell you uh, exactly how much you need to put. Uh, so basically, if you come to the 10 set website and click subscribe, no, sorry, go to gems, and then go to subscribe. It will tell you exactly how much you need to subscribe. You will be locked in for 12 months. But when they launch more IDOs through the Tencent platform, you'll be able to participate in those too. As you can see, we have Meta Hero that was the first one. Kanga Exchange was the next one. And now Everdome. I wasn't a Meta Hero holder, so I didn't qualify for the pre-sale for Everdome for that as well. But of course, I am a Tencent subscriber. So um, yeah, I'll be able to participate in Everdome. Now, I think it's important to have projects like this in the pipeline, especially with the market conditions that we're seeing right now. Okay, guys. Another one is the animal farm okay guys so the animal farm fortunately i managed to free up some capital and get prepared for the animal farm launch okay guys and i am in the drip garden okay and um yeah i'm basically making passive income i'm also in uh, the drip network faucet uh, where i'm making passive income the price of drip network is now up to 88 dollars okay it was about 93 dollars when i last checked 88 dollars okay guys so the price of drip is going up I've got a second account for Drip now. So I'm basically building up my passive income. I'm making funds available for IDOs. I'm subscribing to IDOs. That's how I'm trying to do it this year. Okay, guys, I did miss out on a few IDOs because, uh, you know, I didn't uh, manage to pick up some of the other tokens I, I am looking at. Okay, guys, if you look at Card Starter, um, I believe that's down. The whole market is down, guys. You can be able to pick up these IDO projects at a very low prices if you look at card star that's way down very good uh, very good time to be buying card star potentially uh, and you know dca in, into that if we look at ada pad and all of the bluezilla projects like you know meta v pad and so on everything is down guys and the tiers for the subscriptions do not change on these launch pad projects okay so when you're picking up down here you can get into the the, the ideos I mean, look, 14 million market cap. I'm not sure what it was over here, but I'm sure it was a lot higher than that. But right now, it's the lowest that it's ever been. Ada pad, another one, BSC pad. Let's take a look at BSC pad. Uh, BSC pad. All right, guys, that's another one that I did manage to get into uh, an idea on this uh, just the once. Um, I weren't too impressed with the allocation that they gave me, but it still did 100x um but yeah i mean everything's down guys so you can take advantage of these another one is nft launch uh, which recently um uh, i believe it might be one of the most recent ones nft launch okay guys we have velus pad uh, or vlx pad which is another one that i got into and um yeah guys this is how i'm positioning myself this year i'm looking at these launch pads and i'm basically picking them up potentially picking them up for cheap 
and they're taking advantage of the IDOs at launch. Of course, Bluezilla is one of the biggest, uh, the biggest IDOs. VPad, not to mention VPad, that's one of the ones that we've been talking about on the channel. Managed to get into a few IDOs on VPad as well, and that is also falling at the time of recording this video. Okay, guys, so you're gonna be able to pick up loads of these things for cheap. This is how you can potentially play it in this market. IDOs, launch pads. You know, we've seen people crush it last year with these. I don't think it's going to end there. All right, guys. So, positioning yourself to be able to take advantage of those new opportunities for very new projects hitting the market this year. I think that's where you're going to make a lot of money. 100x, 1,000x, and, and so on. All right, guys. So, it's just a little market strategy for you. While the rest of the market is falling, we can take advantage of, you know, some of these other altcoins that are falling and leverage those to make even more money you know in the long term all right guys so that being said it's the end of the video make sure you go and check out everdome all right guys i believe we're going to see massive growth in this project okay guys with the uh, the team that's behind it um you know the history with meta hero and so on of course i haven't gone through all the tokenomics and all that sort of stuff but you guys can take a look for yourselves go and do your own research but yeah guys make sure you subscribe to the channel like and comment on the video that helps with the youtube algorithm and i'll definitely see you guys in the very next video